It's just been a wonderful ride and we've had so many different experiences and so many different stages and we're just having the best time together. Michael J. Fox and his wife Tracy Pollan reflect on their upcoming 35th anniversary and life as empty nesters. It's empty yeah. nest but it's not really empty nesters. They're all back tonight except for Esme. It's at school but um, we all get together enough that we don't, we're not heartbroken but but it is, it is a new stage in life to be, be uh, have all the kids gone. Well, it's not as empty as you would think. When you have four, there's usually somebody One. home, so there's like a little straggler usually, but it's fun. We enjoy the stragglers. The couple opened up about their lives during the Michael J. Fox Foundation Gala for Parkinson's research, where Tracy also revealed how her husband inspires her. I would have to say every day he doesn't inspire me because he's human and, and it's more like can you just pick the dirty socks up off the floor but so so on a day-to-day -day basis I think it's just sort of a little bit more regular life than that but if you look at the big picture and you look at like tonight and and all of the big things and you know then obviously it's incredibly inspirational but we live a very Normal life. Plus, Michael reacts to being awarded with an honorary Oscar at the Governor's Awards in November for his efforts to help cure Parkinson's disease. That is so exciting and so. so celebrating me is, is is overrated. It's a it's yeah it's there's a lot of <laughs> in in the last little bit there's been lots to celebrate and lots of celebrating, but I'm enjoying yeah. it. The Michael J. Fox Foundation has helped raise over $1.5 billion to help find a cure for Parkinson's disease, a nervous system disorder Fox was diagnosed with at the age of 29. Well, the B word is nice. The C word is going to be better than cure. Um, I think that uh, one thing I felt this time, uh, coming to this part of the year when we, when we do this, is that I, I, I feel it's okay to feel a little pride and to feel like, like I'm proud of what we've done. I'm proud, of, I'm proud of Tracy, I'm proud of all of our friends that have, that have done this, and, and it's, it's a remarkable thing. 